Hey guys, what is going on? My name is Brian and I'm going to be teaching you how to play Havana by Camila Cabello. So to get started with the song, all you're going to be needing is your guitar on standard tuning and you're going to be needing a capo on the third fret. Alright? This song is going to consist of three different chords and we'll be able to dive straight into them right now. So the first chord you're going to be playing is an E minor. So you're going to grab your index and your middle finger and you're going to put it on the second fret of both the fifth and the fourth string. All right, the next chord you're going to be playing is a C chord. We're going to get our ring finger and we're going to place it down on the third fret of the fifth string. We're going to get our middle finger, put it down on the second fret of the fourth string. And then we're going to, head, going to go ahead and get our index finger and we're going to put it down on the first fret of the second string. Alright, so mind you, you do have that capo on there, so realize I'm referring to it. And now the last chord we're going to be playing is a B7. Alright, this is probably the more complicated chord in here, but let's dive straight into it. You're going to get your middle finger, you're going to place it down on the second fret of the fifth string. Now you're going to grab your index, you're going to place it down on the first fret of the fourth string. With your ring finger, you're going to place it down on the second fret of the third string and now finally your pinky you're going to grab it and put it down on the second fret but of the very first string all right and this is how they should sound So for the strumming pattern, what we're going to be doing is fairly simple as well. For the E minor, we're going to strum down twice, and then we're going to release and go up. And within that time that we're going up, we're trying to get our hands to go over to C, and we're going to go strum down and up. Alright? So this is how it should look so far. Once again. And then you slowly switch over to B7, and here you're going to be strumming and muting upward, alright? So, so the whole thing together should sound like this, I'm going to play it slow for you. Just like that, you guys got the whole song nailed down. It does pretty much the whole repetition throughout the entire song. It's extremely catchy and you're going to fall in love with it. Uh, do practice that B7. I know it's a little bit uh, on, the, on the odd side. But, uh, you know, give it some time. You will get it down. And I promise you, you're going to be able to jam out with all your friends. And it's amazing to sing along to. So anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. My name is Brian, and I have my Instagram page down below. I have all my other social medias, but show my Instagram page some love. Uh, I'm trying to build it up, and it'd be awesome if I could have your support on it. So anyways, guys, thank you for watching, and I hope you are having a phenomenal day. So see you around.